Hello everyone, uh, welcome to our channel. In this video, we will show you uh, a demo of our uh, checkout plugin called Instantio. We will first show you uh, a full installation tutorial, how to install both the free version and the pro version. Then we will show you a full demo and feature of our plugin. So let's get started. So first of all, if you, in order to install, just go to your dashboard and click add new on the plugins and search Instantio and now from here you just need to click install. Now you need to click activate. So once you do that, you will see a notice that Instantio requires WooCommerce to be installed. So you need to click install now and install WooCommerce. Now you need to click activate. Now let's go and install the pro version in order to install the pro version um, you need to go to our website and click sign in and then you need to fill up the login details Uh, once you are logged in, then you need to go to downloads and then download the plugin. Then you need to go to plugins again on your dashboard, click add new, click upload and then let's upload the plugin you just downloaded. Click activate now install pro will ask you to activate um, the latest version so in order to get the license code you need to go to a uh, account and click on licenses so once you click on licenses you will see this page and here you will see the license key you need to copy and paste the license key here so once you add the code uh, you will see this information that the license is activated now um, let's go to the settings uh, before going into the settings I, I would like to share that this plugin is basically based on WooCommerce so first of all you need to make sure the theme you are using it's WooCommerce compatible otherwise there may be design and other issues so for this tutorial we will install a WooCommerce compatible theme for now you can use any theme for your website just make sure it's uh, WooCommerce compatible so we will install the famous storefront thing okay so we have now installed the theme now let's go to our setup So we will show you one by one option. So first of all, the direct checkout button. So here is the demo of the direct checkout button. So if you click add to cart. So if you click, so there is the checkout now button. 
if you click the checkout now it will be directly check out here okay um, so so now let's go to the other option let's select side card oh on the direct checkout button there is another option to uh, add custom url so if you add any url the checkout button will go to that url instead of the default checkout um, then we go to the side card so if we select side card so now if we add to card so this is basically side card so you can go to the card and you can also go to checkout and then the pop-up card if we click pop-up card so same process pop-up card is basically this is the pop-up card um, so uh, on the free version there are also some design options for example you can change the color icons and we are also working on adding other color options as well which will be coming up in the future versions on the direct checkout button we have some other color options as the currently and on the other options inshallah within one or two week um, the design options will be available so now let's show you a demo of the pro version so So on the pro if we click add to cart if we click here so if we click post to checkout so as you can see we are doing everything on the same page without any page reloading and if you go to the single product page the same process if i add to cart i can check out easily from here so everything is basically within the same page and there is also an option for single step so if we select single step we can easily skip the multi skip that multi step process so everything will now be on the same page there you go um, so there are some other options so you can show on directly the checkout page if you want to hide on the checkout or card page there are options you can disable a quick view you can also select the active window if you select checkout then the card will not show the checkout will show on the design part we have options for almost all the colors and everything you can also upload custom images you can also add custom css um, so uh, that's basically a full demo of the plugin i hope you have enjoyed or understood everything I shared let me know in the comments if you have any questions and the purchase link of our plugin is on the description below thank you